I. <laughs> I am so hot and tired. So hot and tired. It's been a week since I did a vlog and it has been one heck of a week. This is the week I got myself packed for the move. What is today? It, every day is Blur's Day <laughs> when you're packing and purging and moving, but I, I, it's Sunday. Okay, Sunday. Doesn't feel like a Sunday. I don't even know what day it feels like. Feels like who knows what day. And it's been over a hundred here. And Oregon is infamous for its lack of, of air conditioning. So, I mean, we have, I have a window unit, I have a unit upstairs, but pretty much I've had the windows open and the fans blowing and it's finally under 90 degrees in the house. Yeah, everything's melty, especially me. And today is the day I packed my proverbial ass off and banged the heck out of my literal shin. That's one. Where's the other one? Oh, there. Where'd it go there? See? I banged up my legs. Yeah. And I got paint all over everything, including right here on my shirt. This was used to be a shirt I liked a lot. Now it's a paint shirt. So I'll keep it, but yeah, it's a paint shirt. Um, what else has today been about? Noticing all the things that I had not gotten to. So I took care of my art supplies. I have a lot of art supplies. Two 50 gallon plastic bags filled with empty bottles after I transferred all the different colors to really big bottles to minimize content and space to fit in the boxes and to fit into my new place. This house is, including the basement, 1,800 square feet. Not not ginormous by any chance. It's a it's a small three bedroom cottage built in 1929. So it's 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 cute. It's small. I mean, all the rooms are small, but 1,800 square feet shrinking down to 750 square feet. Plus, well, maybe I'll get a thousand square feet total, including a large storage area under the eaves. But it'll be god awful hot in in the summer and really cold in the winter. It's not, uh, <laughs> I can't think of the word. My vocabulary, which is usually exhaustive, has been exhausted and I can't think of words. I think I have three brain cells right now and they're not cooperating with each other. So what was I just saying? <laughs> I realized about 30 minutes ago when I was walking from room to room and I could not remember when I got into the room why I had come into the room and I go back to the room where I was before and I still couldn't remember why I had gone into the other room. I was literally walking around, banging into boxes, banging my shins and I decided I'd had enough. I've had enough. I'm done. I've got every single mirror and I have a lot of mirrors. Mirror and paintings that I'm going to be hanging in the new place into the back of my car and it's it's like up to up to the top of the car up to the roof filled with all kinds of stuff so tomorrow I am driving out to Dallas Dallas Oregon the little d and I'm going to be first I have to go get my cashier's check with first last and security deposit and cash because I'm buying a mattress that my friend Robert, hi Robert, he's delivering. I get to meet Robert for the first time. That'll be fun. And his, his wife is putting in some extra sheets for me. So that'll be nice. And we'll get the bed ready. And then I'm going to load, I don't even know how many, how many loads. It took me probably, probably a dozen trips from the basement to the car. And I parked the car in the front yard because... I had to minimize how much of a distance I had in the heat, in the 100 plus heat. So on the other end tomorrow, and hopefully it's before, be, before, oh my brain, before things get too hot, I will have to go up the, um, is it 21? Steep Victorian steps to get up to my second floor apartment to get all of the mirrors and the art into the storage area 
So it's one less thing the movers have to contend with. And then I will come back here, take all of the moving blankets that I use for the art and wrap up all of my hand painted stuff individually by hand and schlep that out either tomorrow evening or Tuesday during the day. And then my son and Robin will work to get all of the stuff in the basement to the main floor and all of the stuff from the top floor to the main floor. And it's not a lot, but there's some. And all the boxes into the front yard. I need to show you, I packed 40 boxes, okay? 40 boxes. I wanna show you this wall here of boxes. Let me get the, okay, see that? See all those, see all those? And up, yep, the wall of boxes. Let me get back here. Did I get that right? Okay. So yeah, 40, 40 boxes. I have things. Clothes, knickknacks, mostly art supplies, because I do art. Yes, I do art. I'm also going to be doing coaching. So for those of you who are wanting to work with me for coaching slash hypnotherapy, let me know. Because I will be taking on a few select clients um those of you who really feel the desire to work with me if you've read along with my facebook posts and you've watched me coach myself and you'd like to work with me i do it very intuitively so i've got lots of tools i've been trained in all kinds of modalities and i've collected a lifetime worth of tools and i'd love to help you work on whatever's causing you a disturbance or a limitation in your life so it should be um, a lot of fun, transformative fun. And I'll continue doing my art classes and I'll continue making my art and whatever else I feel inspired to do. So I mostly wanted to connect because it's been a week since I did anything. Ah, bug, something in my back. It's been a week since I did anything with the blog and I'm going to be uh, alone in my apartment for the foreseeable future. So it would be, I'm probably going to do more of these. This helps me to feel connected. I hope you guys feel connected too. And if there are topics you would like for me to take on, topics that are of interest to you, topics you want to explore, whatever they are, I'd love to hear from you. And if I don't know about it, I will do my research and I'll find out about it. Is there anything else I wanted to say tonight? I I'm telling you, my, my brain feels like a vacant space. It's, I don't even know what adjectives to use. I feel exhausted. <sighs> Looking forward to getting some sleep tonight after I do a few more things. I've got a few more things I need to get done, but I'm going to relax and, um, Stay tuned because the great moving adventure is continuing. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm making this vlog. It's so nonsensical. It doesn't even make any sense. Yeah. <laughs> it's also redundant. <laughs> well, um, check back in on another day when I just might have all of my brain cells with me and fully cooperating. Until then, see ya.